Artificial intelligence. The future is now. Artificial intelligence is no science fiction fantasy. Its many applications, from medical to military and social uses, are fast becoming a reality in our daily lives. Here's how. Part one: The game. The future began on 15th March 2016. The occasion was a Go contest between one of the world's grand masters, Lee Sedol, and an AI program called AlphaGo. Go is an ancient and profoundly complex Chinese board game. In fact, it has more possible configurations than there are atoms in the known universe. Chess, in comparison, is child's play. There is not a mathematically more complex problem that you can think about than Go, says David Selinger, one of the scientists behind AlphaGo. Even so. The significant thing wasn't that AlphaGo easily won the contest; it was that AlphaGo was never taught to play by human programmers. AlphaGo learned by itself, first by studying thousands of human games, then by playing millions of games on its own. Hardly anyone followed the tournament in the West, but it was watched by millions in China, including President Xi Jinping. The result stunned the country. The self-taught machine not only played better than its human adversary, but it played with grace, imagination, and extremely innovative tactics. It demonstrated that both human intelligence and creativity, in many domains, may soon be outdone. The following year, China's president Xi Jinping announced a highly ambitious national plan to become the world's dominant power in AI. By the year 2030, this is a momentous drive," says Dr. Qiu Jin of the London School of Economics. The nation has mobilized all national resources to gain technological supremacy with an intensity unseen since Chairman Mao striving to attain nuclear power. Part two, the data. It is often said that data is the new oil. This is why so many apps and internet services are free. What interests the companies is not our money, but information about our thoughts, interests, and movements. When we pick up our telephone or use our computer, every detail is recorded in gigantic data farms, and that immense mass of data is growing exponentially. Already, it is estimated that an extraordinary ninety percent of all the world's information has been generated in the past two years. The entirety of humanity's culture, research, and writings, for example, is less than half the data that has been collected by eBay alone. Most of us typically do not care. The information collected about us seems unimportant. Yet this information is so valuable that the data farms are guarded like gold depositories, with mobile AI security guards on permanent patrol among the servers. Why? Because our data is the key to AI. Just as AlphaGo was given thousands of Go games to study, the AI computers are using all of this data to study humans. These AI computers are learning to comprehend us, both as groups and as individuals. This means understanding our opinions, our personalities, our behavior, and even our private, unspoken thoughts, and not just those of the average person you understand, but those of you personally. Part three, the power. A leading authority on AI, Professor Stuart Russell of the University of California, Berkeley, says, "The time that we are now living in is a crossroads for the human race. If we get it right, it could be a golden era for humanity. We could abolish poverty and disease. If we get it wrong, we could create a technology-reinforced global dictatorship." We could even lose control over the world to our own technology. On the plus side, AI has untold riches to offer us. It is already revolutionizing medicine, and we are only seeing the tip of a very large iceberg. On a social level, a society partly organized by AI could be better and more sustainable than anything we as humans could ever achieve. And as it improves. AI will even bring us emotional support. 
But it could also be a nightmare, straight from movies such as The Terminator or The Hunger Games. Today, for example, there is a frantic AI arms race in progress, and autonomous AI drones have already been used to track and kill individuals by world militaries. These are, in effect, Terminators. Other AI nightmares already exist. In the smart city of Chongqing in western China, facial recognition cameras track citizens' every movement. The police use emotional analysis AI to detect when a suspect is lying or anxious, a computer score judging them guilty without evidence. This is the future facing most of China's population under the Communist Party's AI plan. I'm constantly reminded of George Orwell's lessons in his book 1984, says Microsoft President Brad Smith. The fundamental story was about a government that could see everything that everyone did and hear everything that everyone said all the time. Well, that didn't come to pass in 1984, but if we're not careful, it could come to pass in 2024.